Hey, hello everybody, and welcome back to Fallout 3! Alright, you guys. Not search that man. Alright, we came in, there was a whole bunch of stuff there, we gathered a whole bunch of stuff, there's a whole bunch of stuff on the shelves there. We kind of looked around, there's a staircase up. We came from that door. No door on the left, let's go see if there's a door over this way. There does not appear to be so. Alright, we got a door going inside of that room. And we got a staircase that goes into a door up there. And it appears that it goes to that door, which leads to more catwalks, you guys. <coughs> Hello there. Do you do something special? <coughs> click, 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 beep, beep. See what this is. Wow, there's a lot of scrap in here, you guys. Lots of materials, too. Sector A terminal. Growing! Winning! Wishing that that was the right one. <laughs> this puzzles me. I wish it would just encase me and maybe have a handle that I could just pull to release it. I don't know, you guys, I'm friggin' nuts. What the hell? There's no words. <laughs> oh, it would be nice if it was welcome, you guys. Ooh. Oh, she's fertile, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, what do you got for me? The note from management regarding Sector B. Make sure the main platform and repair sector is probably Interesting. Let's go ahead and kill those turrets. If there's any left, I think we already blew them up, but uh, you never know. Damn this door. Alright. Staircase up. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Literally standing right beside it. Okay. What we got here? Sector B terminal. Hiya! Oh, there it is, you guys. I did the Hiya Ninja password, you guys. Note from management regarding Sector B. Is this the same shit? Yes. Let's not shut down the security in here because I want the experience points for killing it. Oh, I can definitely hear bad boy robots, you guys. Yep. Say goodnight. place to shoot from this is, man. We're not even in the room yet. What the shit is that in the background? Oh, <laughs> you won't do that to me again. I'll tell you what. Dogmeat! How the hell did you get in there, Dogmeat? I will melt him. I love you, my dog. Watch out, watch out! Please be alive, dog meat. Yeah. Here, buddy. Oh, he's actually okay? Is that RL? Okay, it is RL. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. I was like, damn, he's moving fast. <laughs> okay, let's all relax. There appears to be protectrons everywhere. There appears to be repairs going on there. Activate the switch. 
Oh, we turned on the lights. Oh, wait a minute. Come on. My goodness. I didn't mean for that to happen to you, sir. Excuse me, sir. I have a feeling that we're doing something good right now because I think if this were to come to a fight, the more of them that are dead, the better. Are you good? You happy? You okay there? You can come out now. Huh. Why is he like that? It's like he has no, um... <clears throat> it's like he has no, nothing to do or something. Like he's not, he hasn't been programmed. So he's just standing there. I'm not really sure, you guys. This place is, uh... Kind of strange. What else do we got in here? Computer. Repair sector terminal. It's the same shit. Operate lift. Uh, I'm not touching that right now. We will wait. What's this? Same shit? Okay, so that terminal over there can raise and lower the platform, whatever that means. I, oops, it is. It, <clears throat> I still haven't seen uh, the platform, so I really don't know what that means. Damn, all these repair pods are like toast. Hey, buddy. You good? All your systems? Move along, please. Alright, have a good one. <laughs> Be easy. Okay. Well, this appears to be the platform here. Though it looks like it is very much busted. I don't think we're getting that fixed. You know what I'm saying? Like, that looks very busted. <laughs> Not coming back busted. Yep, that scared the crap out of me. to the Mechanist Forge, you guys. <clears throat> are we back in the front lobby? Holy crap, we are. What the? Oh, you son of a bitch. Scrap metal, you guys. Damn, well, I mean, I guess. We are in a robot repair facility, you know what I'm saying? Okay. There what is. are you doing in here? How did you get past my defenses? 
Did the antagonizer send you? No, man. Speak now, citizen, or I'll be forced to detain you until I can ascertain your true motives. <laughs> Look at his outfit, you guys. That's so cool. Hmm. Okay, so we have the option of, like, joining him to go kill the antagonizer. We have the option of killing him or talking it out, which is what we're supposed to do. So I'm here to, I'm just here to talk, man. Uh, we can find a peaceful way to stop this fighting. I realize you mean well, but I'm afraid you're being naive. The antagonizer is a mad woman, and the only thing that will stop her is force. As much as I wish peace were an option, the antagonizer is too deluded, too inhuman to listen to reason. By the ghost. Sadly, Sometimes the scaly claw of tyranny must be destroyed by the cold, unfeeling pincers of justice. Jeez. Oof. 20%, you guys. Hmm. Why did you decide to become the machinist? Or the mecha mechanist? Long ago, I was a mere citizen like yourself. Beyond the talent for computers, I had no power in this world. But then the antagonizer attacked and killed someone very dear to me. The damage was too much for me to fix her. But I knew what I had to do. That tragedy burned away the weakness of my previous life. And in the fires of revenge, the mechanist was forged. You just want to keep fighting the antagonizer. You're just as bad as she is. Lies. Slander. I'll never let you compare a noble hero like myself to that, that base villain. Mm. Now it's all clear to me. You're an agent sent by the antagonizer oh, using no. your honeyed words to trick me into letting down my defenses. Mm. No, no. Well, the jig is up. Prepare to face the burning nope. lasers of justice, evildoer. Don't, don't, don't do it, sir. Please. Oh, no, you guys. <laughs> We're right outside the door. Oops, God damn, didn't mean to close the door there. Let's not forget this, uh... Scrappity scrap metal, you guys. Is there anything else in here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we gotta make sure not to say that to him again. What are you doing in here? Alright. Uh, just here to talk. I rip. Okay, okay, okay. Why did you decide? He tells us about that. <clears throat> Suppose you're right. Maybe we can work together. Aha! That's the spirit, chum. You seem quite capable. You got to me, after all. You can be my official sidekick. I'm afraid I don't have another suit, though. Mm -mm. But we can deal with that problem later. We've got bigger ants to fry. Now, how to proceed? There's bound to be a peaceful solution. I'll try to convince her to give up. The antagonizer does not listen to reason. She does not understand true human emotions, like mercy or love. She's nothing more than an animal, and you can no more talk her into surrender than you can play chess with a mole rat. But I will not stop you from trying. I only hope that you live long enough to learn the error of your ways. Holy crap. I know. I know, Dougmeat. There's a whole bunch of stuff everywhere. Don't need that. RL is also full, so... Oh, oh a friggin' nuka grenade. Oh!
I'm kind of looking for, like, his robot that he was talking about as well. Because I think that might be a way to get it. To work things out. Ugh. What the heck is that? Oh, motorcycle gas tank. Like, what in the world? I trust <laughs> everything is ex... Gotta go. Let's get a game save. We're gonna try that speech, you guys. Make it fast, citizen. It Shit. Which is just... <laughs> <laughs> Never know. Always a chance. We need to go talk to the uh, the ant agonizer now, you guys. Agonizer, you guys. Uh, uh, and, uh, uh, and we slide. Uh, perfect. <laughs> oh, the caravan. And here you are. The spirits have blessed me with many gifts, but you have given the more marketable gift of monetary investment. Yeah, baby, I see you all Please over the place. Accept this offering. A mask and helmet made from the hide of the wisest spirits of the wind. May it benefit you as fully as it has myself. A what now? Crow's I bought helmet added, you guys. Have a look. Holy See if anything calls out. Crap, you guys. Holy combat armor! That's insane. Let's see what his repair skill is. Oh wow. 79%. We actually get our friggin' Tesla helmet fixed. Might as well. Two percent? No, no. Stay safe on the path you travel. Man, Good you, you. you too. Perception plus one. Let's see what it looks like. Holy shit, it's friggin' huge. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy looking, yo. That thing's huge. <laughs> That's pretty sweet, though. See what she has to say. Oh, she's there, all right. Whoa, look at her! Yes. So at last, you've penetrated the court of the antagonizer, queen of all ants. Were you sent by that meddling mechanist? He'll learn that no one can stand before my royal regimen of fighting ants. Explain yourself. Why shouldn't I have my pretties kill you where you stand? Hmm. Jeez. 
Uh, all three of these are bad options. Your days of terrorizing the town are over. Give up, and you won't get hurt. Ha <laughs> ha! You would walk here and presume to command me? Humanity's time has come to an end. Your kind died because it knew only petty bickering and wars. But not so, the noble ant. It works with its brethren, knowing only loyalty and duty. And this is why they have grown, while humanity crumbled. Once I've finished with that pathetic mechanist, I will be free to spread my colonies across the wastes. Alright, calm down, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> you do realize you're not really an ant, right? Hmm. 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 Should I play to her morality if she has any? Or should I try satirical? She seems kind of like a pretty serious person, though. Let's try satirical, you guys. You got this antagonizer idea from a comic book, didn't you? What? No! No children's book could possibly capture the true depth of the antagonizer! Hmm. <coughs> yeah, Grognak, you guys. Oh, shit, Grognak would whoop your sorry ass up and down, girl. But I don't want to say that. I have a feeling that she's gonna want to fight if I say that. I read that the antagonizer was an orphan girl who could still be redeemed. You... you really believe that? When I read that comic, it explained so much. Where I came from. Who I was destined to be. What I had to do. Well, the truth. But it never said the antagonizer could ever have a chance to go back to being normal. It never said I had a chance. Please, I, I think I've made some terrible mistakes. If you really think I still have a chance, just let me go. I'll give you the suit. No one ever has to see the antagonizer again. Just please, let me have another chance. Oh, say word. The antagonizer's costume and helmet added. No way, you guys. I have time to die. <laughs> Certainly. Good luck in your new life. Thank you. I don't know how I can... Just thank you. Look at her hair model, eh? That's a very unique hair model that she has. Oh, well, she has a ripper on her waist. Did you see that? Uh, okay. And now, we need to go back and tell the, the mechanist that it's all over. RL's on the lookout, you guys. <clears throat> uh, I can't move. I can't move. Hmm. <laughs> Progress, you guys. We're making progress. As if we got her costume. Let's check it out. Oops. Sick. Oh, yo! That's so sick! Dun, 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 it's Doug and Man and Robot. I guess. <laughs> da, 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 yeah, the durability actually isn't too bad on it. If you didn't have power armor yet, that would actually be an, an alright uh, thing to wear. Although it brings your charisma down, I guess, just because you look like an, a bit of an idiot wearing it. But. Well, I wonder if he's going to give us his costume too. That would be sick, yo. <laughs> I'm out of my mind, you guys. Happy that we're uh, completing this quest. At least so far we are. Now, we've gone bad with this guy before, so let's go ahead and get a game save. 85 hours, you guys. Well done. You have defeated the vile antagonizer, certainly have. and you've brought back her suit so that we may destroy the last taint of her villainy. No, don't you dare. Hand it to me, and I'll make sure that no one else can ever bear the mantle of the foul antagonizer. 
now. Huh. Wait. First, let's talk about what you've been doing. Quickly, then. Evil never pauses to contemplate its actions. So I see little reason that we should, either. Hmm. God damn it. Why do you want the suit? I can hardly leave it lying around for someone else to find, now can I? The threat of the antagonizer must be put to an end forever. I must not let her threaten all that humanity holds dear. Even now, Twisted Souls may seek to continue her legacy. Okay. I really don't want to give it to him. You don't need to worry about this suit. There are other threats out there. You raise an excellent Yes! Morality! It would only slow down my reckless assault upon evil. Now I must return to tending my robots. Yeah. Canterbury may be safe, but I must now look to the rest of the waste plan. Yeah. The antagonizer may be gone, but if the world is ever threatened again, the mechanist must be ready. Dun, 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 you guys. We did it. <laughs> we did it, you guys. We did both of them, too. I figured it was only going to be a, a one or the other kind of thing, because that's usually that's usually the way that Fallout works. But we actually got both of them to chill out, and we got to keep that costume as well. I guess that mission is for you to get a a unique armor and if you went the other way you'd get his armor instead of hers which is pretty cool so now we gotta go get our reward <laughs> this game's crazy man I freaking love this game so much oh please let me make it god damn it I never did get to give you the official welcome to the town, did I? Huh. Welcome to Canterbury Commons, home of traders, caravanners, and most of all, of excellent bargains. Here for business or pleasure? Interesting. <coughs> I'm all business. What types have you got to offer? Damn near all of them, depending on which caravans in town. Guns, armor, food, junk. Pretty much everyone swings by the old circle eventually. Yeah. Everyone but slavers, that is. It's a hassle to transport their wares, as they say. Just as well, eh? Anything else I can do to welcome you to town? Hmm. Took care of both of them. There won't be any more fighting in the streets. That's grand. I do believe it's fair to say you've saved Canterbury. And unlike that mechanist, you did so with significantly less stress all around. Come on, big experience points. Now, I do believe this is our agreed-upon payment for your fine services rendered, and a little bonus as a special thank you. Yes, I always like bonuses, baby. 400 bucks. 390 experience points. Chivo. Mission complete. See you Bye. later. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, kid? You're bad. I don't think I should talk to you. Oh, uh, he doesn't like me anymore because I kind of ended his little real-life comic book situation. Sorry, kid. Gotta go, man. So long. Hey. It's all right, man. There'll be other stuff that'll happen. You'll grow up and you'll forget about all these comic book weirdos and all this other stuff and you'll be a great warrior one day. Alright, little kid? Oh, he's so sad, you guys. We, like, totally ruined the fun, you know? Yeah, you see my robot? He's pretty sweet, eh? You like him? His name's RL3. He's pretty sweet, huh? Hmm. This game is so friggin' good, man. Holy crap. Well, thank you guys so much for coming out 
and oh, watching this episode. Get so boring. I know, man. I didn't. I didn't mean for it to happen. Like you know, like you know what I mean. But don't worry, man. Life will go on, my friend. Life will go on. You never know. And uh, you know, they're, they're still here. The uh, yeah, yeah, dog meat, right? Dog meat. Yeah, yeah. See, dog meat's right. Continue on, little one. I must. Howdy, Mister. Hey, you see, we're all everything's better now. You see. Leave me alone so I can do my outro. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys, man, for coming out and watching this episode of Fallout 3. If you've ever leave a like on the video, maybe even subscribe to the channel, you guys. We're going to explore this place a little bit more in the next episode, I guess. Take a walk around the town a bit. See if there's any more things to do here. But, uh, yeah, man, I freaking love you guys, and I wish you guys the total best. Hope you guys have a freaking awesome rest of your day. And, of course, oh, I will... you made this place get so boring. Look at the tiny little Nuka cola he has. Did you guys see how small it was? What the hell? Yeah, man. See you guys in the next one. Have a good one. <laughs> bye, bye.